Welcome to Screwing Morning Wood with Still No Couch. Today we're going to talk about um, how to handle morning wood. This is the wood I woke up with this morning. And so first let's go over our tools. Obviously, you know, beer mandatory. Now this is a, a, a multi-driver. Um, because if you look at it, uh, the reason they call them multi-drivers is because when you turn them this way, see there, it's, it's, a, it's a time sign. You can multiply with it because it's like times, you know, two times two is six, that kind of thing. But if you turn it just 45 degrees in any direction, you get an addition driver. So there's multi-driver, multiplication driver, and addition driver. That's very, very, very useful, very, very functional tool. Then of course you have your uh, regular pokey thing. I think I, I whatever. Uh, what are we talking about? Screw screwdrivers. That's what we're talking about. Yeah. Now what I like about this right now in its current, I like this because there's several things. Number one, like right now it's in its manual configuration. You see, it's manual. You can uh, stab things with it and and poke things with it. Um, now, what I, the other thing is what you can do with these is you can, you can easily convert these into a powered screwdriver, you know, electric screwdriver. So what you want to do is you want to, number one, important safety tip here. Uh, you don't want to do this really in the dark or if, if things are slippery. You want to make sure you have, you know, traction, you know, that you can really get a good grip on things because it's easy to slip it into the wrong hole. So uh, let's see, we'll find the right hole. Oh, that's no, oh, there you go. It fits in that one. So we'll just put that in there. Now I have, now we have, uh, an, you know, an electric screwdriver, see? So that's, that's pretty cool. Now to convert it back, you want to just, oh, fuck, shit. God, fuck, son of a bitch. Fucking Jesus, Jesus, my ring is hot. Fuck. Ah. Oh. All right. Well, important safety tip. Uh, important safety tip. When you plug in your your, your manual screwdriver into it, it's, it's it's electric configuration. You wanna don't ever unplug it. Okay. Uh, either that or just just call your son and have have him him unplug the damn thing. Son of a bitch. God damn. Fuck. Uh, anyway, now I, I dug around in my old photo albums to figure, uh, uh, excuse me, uh, uh, screw collection to, to, to find an old screw. This is, a, this is an old screw. I've, I've, I've screwed this, uh, I don't know, a thousand times, man. It's got a little, little, it's a little crusty now. It's got some old cream cheese or something on it. I don't know what the hell that is. Anyway, so here's an impor another important safety tip is when you're using, uh, unless it's a brand new screw, you always wanna, you know, wear protection. So, you know, I use these little protective thingies. I don't know what they're called. They're, uh, protective uh, things. Let me see, I can't, it's hard to do with one hand. Uh, anyway, so you get, you, you gotta gently, you, 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 you stick it on the tip, the protection, you stick your protection on the tip and you just kind of gently roll it down. But see, the, this is a problem that I, that I run into all the time. See, the protection's just not big enough to, to cover the shaft, you know? So, but that's fine. I'm just gonna go, I'll just kind of go commando on this a little bit. Now, there's plenty of places to, to you, with your morning wood, and you got you get your you get your good heart morning wood. There's plenty of places to to poke it, you know. And, but you you know most times you know you, you have to kind of find the right spot. Now there's plenty of places to put. Oh, there you go. Protection fell off. There you go. Whatever. Um, we're just gonna go commando. So we're gonna go. You know, there's plenty of places to to to, to stick it, you know. But you want all I have to do is just kind of feel around a little bit, you know. And this is why you don't want to do this 
uh, again in the dark because it gets real easy to get the wrong hole. So you know you find find something. Oh, it slipped in there real nice. So you just kind of give it a little caress, a little a, a gentle little twist at first maybe, and just kind of ooh, inch it in a little bit. And then um, what you want to do is you want to kind of screw, give give it give it give it a, a good couple of twists and stuff. And then after after it's kind of, after things kind of get going, then you just bang the shit out of it. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's instructional video on on how to screw with SNC. Thank you, and may God bless and keep you and yours. Bye bye.